Okay, so we're gonna take those feet directly underneath those hips. Roll those shoulders back and down. Roll them back and down one more time. Let's start with big deep breaths in. Let's inhale up and exhale all the way out. Stretching up nice and tall. Guys, taking the arms directly to the side, take the right leg, left leg lift. Brush it up, up. So if you ever need to, you can always play your own music. So my music a little soft today, but you can at least hear my voice. Good, arms press forward, hug, hug. So activating those abs here. Feeling nice and tall as you stretch the legs a little longer, getting those hamstrings warmed up. Take the arms up to the ceiling. Sit it up nice and tall, big reaches, eight more lifts, eight. Good, we're gonna finish here with press downs, arms go wide, press them down, press, press. So flapping those wings here, lat muscles getting activated. Here's eight, four more, four, three, two, arms forward. You're gonna reach the arms up, step one leg nice and far back. And then stand up and tap the toe to the floor. A little bit faster. We go reach up with a lunge. So I'm gonna turn sideways. Reach up, stepping back. Good. Now at the top, you can either add a passe or add a brush kick. Down, kick. Find that length. Find your breath. Keep going. Reach up, kick. Oops. I can't kick into my chair today. Good, let's hold this lunge down nice and low. Hold, press. Four more, four, three. You're gonna step the foot to the side. So we're gonna do a lunge down, step it out. Step back, step out a little bit fast. We go, step back out. So kind of like a little curtsy and then a side plie step. Last one here. Hold up plie, drop it down, low, high. So find your big or big reach up to the ceiling. Drop those hips a little deeper. Thighs almost parallel to the ground. Take it up to a releve at the top. Drop, lift. Find a little tiny pause on those toes. Four more. There's four, three, last two. Let's slide the feet back together. Arms back to the side. Opposite leg, step back. Step back, stand up. One more slow. And come up, let's take it to tempo here. Down, up. So focusing on that front leg here, squeeze it all the way straight. Keep that head up, chest up, shoulders over those hips. Option, take that knee up to a passe or Brush, kick, down. Reach up, press out. So the arms are nice and strong. As the arms go to the side, imagine squishing your hands on pillows. All right, let's hold that lunge and pulse it down. Press, stand it up nice and tall here. I need a little more room to go to the side. In eight more, we're gonna do that lunge, step to the side, four, three, one, so two slow, lunge nice and low, step out wide. Lunge, step back, step out wide, a little faster. Lunge, out. Reaching those arms up over your head, plie. Awesome job. Can we get lower in those plies? I'm challenging myself this morning. Two more. Let's hold that plie here, drop, lift. All right, second set of plies. Legs should be a little bit warmer. So let's rise up to those toes. Awesome job. Final set, option to add a little tiny jump. Down, little jump. I jump and it's always optional. Take it four more, three, last two. Last one, and take a big deep breath in. And exhale out. Let's grab the band. Taking that band, if you don't have band, that's perfectly fine. 
All right. Let's grab that band around your wrist and grab those weights. Weights in. So I've got 90 degree bend at those elbows. Weights directly in front of me. Feet under those hips. You're gonna keep that 90 degrees. Lift the arms up, lower right back down. So maintain that 90 degrees. Lift and lower, lift. So now we're gonna target the front side of those shoulders. When you lift those elbows, make sure the elbows are not flaring. Keep the elbows directly underneath those wrists. Up to the top, little lifts. So that band is right in front of your face. You come a little closer right here. Elbows directly over those wrists. Four more here, four, three. Stay here, open the arms. Open, open. Now modification is to lower those arms a little bit lower. That helps the shoulders. Working the outer shoulders now. You're gonna keep those elbows up if you can. Stretch the arms forward. Stretch, bend, all the way out and in, out, pull in. Try to make, keep that pressure on the band outward. Now let's hold it all the way out. Little pulls in, pull in. So now it's more the bicep here. Pull, pull, that's it. Here's eight more. You're gonna pull the hand or the elbows into that waist and punch the arms forward. You go pull in, punch forward, pull in. That's it, big reach at that extension. Can you come in, press out, in, press out. All right, last one, hold it all the way out. Straight arms, out, out, ah. Oh. This is so challenging right here. Stay with it, eight more. Arms are slightly at a diagonal or up high at a challenge. Two and one, and come all the way down. Let's set those weights down for just a moment. I'm gonna stay with the band here. I wanna stay with the band. So one hand holds the band, palm face up. The other hand, palm face down. So the band is right in the middle of your chest. Try to keep that top arm nice and steady. From here, you're gonna push the bottom hand down. So come up and push down. Work in those triceps here. You ready? A little bit faster, take it up and down. So to make it a little bit harder, try to go more to a diagonal, more to that hip, to the opposite hip. Less work, you can lower that top arm. More work, you lift that top arm. Keep reaching nice and long, push. Release. Two more. Good, let's do little pushes at the bottom here. Push, push. Ah, oh, that tricep on fire, but we're gonna stay with it. You got eight more like this. Here's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. And come all the way up, switching hands. So the opposite hand now is up. The other hand is pushing down. So hold on that top hand nice and strong. Let's go nice and slow. We're gonna reach down, straight arm, release with control. Press, straight arm. Top arm stay nice and steady. All right, singles, press and release. Press, release. So you're trying to keep that outside elbow nice and steady. As you press that hand down towards that outside hip. Two more singles, pulse it out of the bottom here. Press. We have 16 of these. This is where the burnout happens right now. That's it. Try to get that arm all the way straight. Modify by lowering that hand, top hand a little bit deeper or lower. Four, three, two, and one. And release it there. Great job. Let's set that band down off to the side. Grab those weights again. We're going back to those back muscles. So feet directly under, feet together. Arms forward. We're going to those flies. Fly. Down. Fly. Good. Remember, squeeze behind those shoulder blades. Now take that right foot, step back and in. Take that right foot. Take it back, pull it in. Let's do four more right here. Four, three. Now, the last one, let's hold that foot back. Hold the arms up. Lift that back leg, lift the arms. Pulse it up. Keeping that work in those back muscles. Lower the arms for modification. 
We're gonna sweep those arms over your head. I'm gonna turn sideways. Sweep the arms over your head. We're gonna go up over your head and then all the way back to those hips. Up over your head and back to those hips. Try to stay, find that balance and over. That's it now. And we're gonna hold at to the top. Hold at to the top, turn the palms to face each other. Elbow to knee, we pull it in, push, in, push. Finding that balance here. Pushing those weights forward. Two more. Let's take it up to full speed here. In, press. Find that breath. Always have the option, tapping that toe on the floor. Challenge yourself by hovering. Four, three, two, I pull it in and come up. Shake out that leg. We got the other side to do. So feet back together, palms face in. We go fly. So starting back over, getting ready for that left leg. Add the left leg here, left leg back to your left or choose the opposite foot. The camera flips my side around here. Up. Two more. Pull this one back. Pull says those legs and arms up. Reach. So try to get those shoulder blades squeezing behind your back. Back leg is long, toe is pointed. Four more. I'm gonna turn sideways again. Pull that leg, arm sweeps up over your head. And then all the way back to those hips, up over your head. Trying to keep those hands, those weights elevated. Try not to let them drop. Good, let's go all the way back up to the top. All the way back to the top. Pull it in, press it out. Use those abs to pull that knee in, in, out. Two more slow. Here we go. Double time. Pull, press. That's it, use those abs. Bending leg is bent. Can you get deeper? Woo, losing the balance this morning. Four, three, two, and one. Come all the way up. Great job, let's set those weights down. Coming down for the floor. We have push-ups here. So arms wide, as wide as the mat. Toes separated. I want you to keep your head, neck, and shoulders nice and long. Let's go three counts down. Three, two, one, squeeze, press. Three, two, one, and lift. So nice and controlled down, and then a power press up. Three, two, one, push. Good. Let's go two more, just like that. Three, two, one. Last one here. We have eight singles, down and up, singles, eight, up. Keep breathing, squeeze those legs, pull those abs in, keep that head up, looking at the top of your mat. Two more. Last one, quick stretch, all the way back. Fantastic job. We're gonna do one more set of push-ups here. This time we're gonna do tricep push-ups. I'm gonna go on my knees. I can go a little bit deeper on my knees. So tricep push-ups, hands directly underneath the shoulders. Drop those hips down. So I'm on my knees. I want you to find those abs in nice and tight. The elbows are gonna brush by your shirt. As you lower down, the elbows brush by your shirt and you come up with control. Two counts down, two up. Down for two, press up for two. So I'm gonna turn facing the camera here so you can watch my elbows. You go down and then back up. Notice my elbows do not leave my shirt. Good, a little bit faster, down, up. So elbows are bending back towards your hips and then they squeeze straight, down, up. Two more, last one. Let's go down to the bottom, hold, hold, hold. Go down a little deeper. You can do it one more inch, hold it. Four, three, two, one. Oh, press all the way back. Quick stretch here, sit up. Comfortable seated position, one arm across your chest. Oh, tricep push-ups. Get me today. Let's switch arms. Find that tricep stretch above your head. Nice big inhale and exhale. Maybe lean over to the side and switch. All right, I'm gonna come up, getting ready for those legs. One more stretch of those of that chest inside of the shoulders. Open that chest, 
take a big deep breath in and exhale there. All right, so we're gonna, I'm gonna get my chair ready. Facing the, facing there. All right, we're gonna start in a nice wide second position today. So take the toes out, turn out to that second position. Hand on the bar, hand on the hip, plie, second position, down, up. So again, let's work on that stretch here, trying to get those thighs parallel to the floor. We're gonna add on here. Let's go slower, pull to the bottom, pull to the bottom, lift those heels off the floor, extend the legs straight, and then lower those heels down again. So we're gonna go down, hold, lift, hold, squeeze it straight, and lower those heels a little faster. We go down, up, squeeze it straight, lower. Down, up, squeeze it straight, lower. Find that control here. We have, here's your last time slow. We're gonna take it up one more notch right here. Down, up, up. Down, up, up. All the way down, down. So just like that warm up, we're gonna go down and straight up to those heels. The toes, I mean, down, up to the toes. Let's add the arm, down, up. Now, option to take that hand off the bar and challenge your balance. Can we add a little hop here? Jump at the top, down, up, down. Now, maybe try to take those hands up to the top and hold them. We have four more right here. We're gonna speed up those hops. Two options, no hops and pulse on the toes. Here we go, down, up. Little tiny second position hops, hop. Okay, we have eight more modify here with pulses. Hop, yes, that's it, Katie. I see those hops, four. Three, two, liaise, down. Come back over to that bar. All right. The outside leg is gonna take a curtsy in four and three. Last two. Let's go plie to a curtsy here. So we go plie nice and low. Curtsy arm over your head. Plie wide and lift. Take it to tempo. Out, curtsy. So when you do that curtsy, Hips are square to the front. Hips are level with each, level with each other. Keep going. Two more. Hold that curtsy right here, little presses down. So that front foot is on the ground. The back heel is off the floor. Knees are going out to that diamond shape. You're lifting up nice and tall, four, three, Stay low, lift that front heel, up and down, lift and lower. Maybe add the back heel, drop, lift, drop. All right, we're gonna hold both heels off the floor in two. All right, hold both heels off the floor, little presses. So now those heels are off the floor. Always have that modification of lowering that front heel to the floor, press. I like it, both hands off the bar, yes. We're gonna change it up here, three down, all the way up. Three, two, one, squeeze straight. Three, two, one, squeeze straight. So going down an elevator and then shooting straight up. Three, two, now. Can you challenge your depth here? Go down and up. Go one inch further than you think you can. Two more like that. Three, two, one. All right, here comes singles. All the way down, all the way up. Down, up. Work those inner thighs here. So outer thighs, inner thighs. Keep those sit bones squeezed together the entire time. Now we're gonna take that back leg up to a passe. So it goes down low and then up to a passe. Drop it down and passe up a little bit faster. Down and up. You can always take that hand to the hip and drop that front heel to the floor. Otherwise, try to keep that front heel off the floor, down, drop. Squeezing that inside leg all the way straight. All right, we got two more to the back. Now let's take the outside leg, step forward, step forward, and back to that passe. Step forward and come up a little bit faster. So we go down, up. So that back leg here is bending and squeezing straight, trying to get taller at the top. Squeeze that booty at the top. 
gentle step down. It's not very big. It's a step and lift, gentle step. It's more about that back leg. Let's alternate, take it to the back. Back, up, front, up. Now, as we alternate, I wanna see that inside leg bend deeper, drop. All right, we're gonna go faster. No pocket, just front and back. Front, back, front, back. Taking that arm to the front or to the hip if you need to rest that arm. Katie, I know you know where these are going. Maybe take those arms up. Let's speed up those legs here. Jump, switch, jump. Now jump, switch is optional. You can always go back to that step. A little faster, switch, switch. Keep going. Now I challenge you, can you be super, super tight? Imagine your feet on a salad plate. They're so tight. Legs are straight. Here's an eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Awesome job. Let's grab that chair and move it to the other side. We are ready for the other side. All right. Find that second position, drop. Letting that heart rate come back down. So keep that upper body nice and tall. Here's two more. All right, we're gonna hold it down. Hold it down, heels up and down. Up and down. That's it. Stay nice and low as the heels come off the floor. Your head's not moving. Your hips are not lifting. Let's take it faster. Here we go. Lift, lower, up. Now, get lower in those hips. How low can you go? Have some fun here. Feel that burn and enjoy it. Now those heels come off the floor, hold. Pulse those legs down. Try to take both hands off the bar, maybe up over your head. Get those legs to shake. Drop down a little bit deeper. Here we go. Combo now, or let's say down low, press the knees back. Back, back, press the knees. We're gonna do one set, just knee presses. Then we're gonna put those two together in eight more. In eight more, you're gonna lower the hips and then you're gonna press the knees back. Combo, you ready? Let's go, we go down, up, press. Down, up, press. Down, up, press. Good. Oh, here comes the shake. Get lower if you can. Last two, last one. Here we go, second position, lower those heels. Ah, that feels so good to release. Four more right here. In four more, you're gonna find that plie and then a curtsy. You ready? Here we go. Plie, curtsy, plie. So that inside foot is staying stable. You bend those knees in each position. Open, drop. Good, let's hold this curtsy right here. Hold it, press. Hips are square. Open those knees to that diamond shape. Stay nice and tall. Press. In four, three, lift and lower that front heel. Up and down. I'm gonna come up over to my back. Lift and lower. Can you add both heels? Lift both heels, lower both heels, up. So you want those knees going out and then towards each other as the heels come down. Four, three, last two. This time heels say hi. Pulse that body here, press, press. Maybe take both hands over your head. So your weight is evenly distributed between your front and your back leg. Knees are going out. All right, three down. Three, two, one, squeeze up. Three, two, one. Remember, elevator, going super low. I needed to go away from my bar so I don't put my elbow on the bar. Three, two, one, squeeze up. All right, we got this. We have four more elevators here. Four, down, down, and then power it up. Can you make that power a little bit stronger? Squeeze in those inner thighs. One more elevator here. Three, two, singles down and up. Out, in, I shouldn't say down and up. How about knees out and in? Knees out and in. Four more like this, four and three. We're gonna find that curtsy 
and back leg up to a passe. So he goes curtsy and passe. Drop it low into that curtsy and passe up singles down. So another focus here, not only is that standing leg bending and straightened, the standing heel is staying stable. You don't want that standing heel dropping or, lower, or lowering or lifting. Staying stable. Taller every time. Two more to the back. Let's take it too slow to the front. Front and come all the way up. Drop it down. Take it to singles, down and up. Down. Now you always have the option here of dropping that back heel to the floor. Modification. For that challenge, you keep that heel off the floor. Maybe it's just hovering. Maybe it's all the way up. Your choice. Keep working at challenging yourself. Two more to the front. Let's alternate. Here we go. Alternate back and front. Back, up, front, up. So bend, challenge, get deeper. I want to see that standing leg. Getting that side tail over the floor. No passe. Take out the passe. Front, back, and front. Back, front. Back, front. All right, option to jump. Jump, switch, jump, switch. Slow to start. You can always stay here as well. Otherwise, take it up. All right, how tight can you get those legs? Can you be in your tippy toes? Let's try to bounce a little bit higher here. Find more height. Four, three, two, and one. Awesome job. Grab that band. We're going to do a little hip here. Take that band around your thighs. And you get a quick towel. So make sure the band is on your toes. We're going we're gonna to face the bar at a diagonal. So I'm not completely face. Let's so we have a diagonal here. The inside arm. It's going to rest on the, on the bar. First position of those feet, then the knees. The leg in front. I want you to take it up to an attitude, then turn sideways. That knee is turned out to that side. And I'm going to reach that knee to a diagonal here. Look diagonal, lower. Oh, my booty sore. I did these yesterday. I don't feel it today. So that knee, I'm going to turn sideways, is going backward at a diagonal. You want to keep those hips level with each other. It's not about height, it's about length. Stretching that band as far away from your body as you can. Take it up, hold, little lift, little tiny lift. So, what I'm focusing on here is trying to get the outside of my knee further away from my body. Four more, and four, three, hold that knee, straighten that leg, straighten and bend, straighten. So reach that leg to a diagonal backwards. Diagonal reach. Diagonal reach. Two more. Let's go faster on that extension. Out. Out. Can you get that leg longer? Not tight. Longer. Reach your toes to the floor and then slightly upward. You're going to feel that nice burn in that booty here. Hold it up. We look lower. Left and lower. So we go up and then halfway down. Up. Halfway down. If you need to modify, pop the toe on the floor. Are you bending that standing leg as well? Good. Up to the top, little tiny pulses here. Straight leg pulses. For an added challenge, maybe you elevate that standing foot. Bend that standing leg. Eight more times. Eight. Find that breath. Four more. Four. Three. Two. And one. Come on. Let's take all those legs. Ooh, take more hope. Take Roll up those hips. All right, I'm going to adjust my band. We're going to go to the other side. I'm not going to move my chair, though. So, add a diagonal to your chair. First position, opposite leg to a to a kuko here. So bend that knee. Forearm on the bar, hand on the hip. Lift that knee diagonal. Lower right back down. It goes up and down. Keep going. I am going to turn my bar. Lift. Remember that knee is going down and out to that side here. Lift. As you can, find that little tiny pause at the top 
and release. Hold, release. Two more. Now stay up at the very top, hold, little tiny lift. Up, up. You can see my knee is going to a diagonal. Holding those hips steady. You want to pull that hip forward. Your work is staying in that side glute here. Four, three, hold it, straighten that leg. Straighten and bend. Reach down and up slightly. You're going to feel that hamstring. You're going to feel that glute holding that knee up. Two more, nice and slow. Focus here, pulse it straight. Reach, reach. Can you get that foot a little bit higher? Can you point that toe a little bit more? Eight more. Four more here. Four, three, hold it there, halfway down. We go halfway down, lift it up. Halfway, lift. Standing leg is bent, yes? My standing leg's feeling already. Side two, up. Reach it longer, two more. Up at the top, little tiny pulses. Lift, lift. Are your abs in as well? Shoulders relax. Head up, head long. You have eight more. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Oh, look. Take off those hips. All right. Great job. Let's get a quick stretch. Take off that band. We'll save that band for later. Take one foot. Toss it over your knee and sit down. Just a little booty stretch. And then come up, switch. All right, let's head down to the floor. Take that band with you. We're not going to use it. Oh, let's use it in our hands first. So I'm going to turn sideways, sitting on the mat, feet out in front. Sit up nice and tall. I want you to roll back halfway. You're going to sit back. Imagine you're driving a car. Now, your left hand is going to hold steady. The right hand is going to pull as you twist. You go pull, twist, up, up. So bow and roll in a super position. Yes. Pull and come back up. Last one slow. Singles. Down. So you're driving the car. You're pulling that right arm back. And you're twisting to the right. There's two more. Can we hold this one back? Now hold it, lower that body, and lift, lower, lift. So you're going to hold that arm, now squeeze that right side oblique, down, two, and one, come all the way up. Now ready for the other side, find that car, let's roll back, now the left arm twist, you twist, and come back up. So right arm steady, twist in here. As you twist, that back elbow goes down slightly. Let's take it to singles. Twist. So not only is that shoulder working, I want you to find that squeeze in your oblique. Hip and rib cage squeezing towards each other as you rotate. Got four more here. Four. Three. Here's two. Now hold this one. Hold this one. Now lower that body. Down. Up. Keep that stretch on the band. Working that oblique here. Hip and rib cage. Lower. Lift. Two more. And last one. Let's come all the way up. Take that band around the thighs. Take the band around the thighs. All right. We're going to lay arms to back. Legs at tabletop. My knees are together. Taking those hands behind your head. Legs at tabletop. Just the upper body. Lift the upper body and lower right back down. We go lift. The basic press lift. Knees at tabletop. You want to create a cradle for your head. Keeping that neck relaxed. Let your head just relax in those hands. Put the work in those abs. Two more. Last one. We're going to hold to the top. Hold to the top here. Now let's straighten the legs out. Straighten the legs out and then pull them back in. We go out, up. The modification here is to go more to the ceiling. Just go straight up. For a challenge, you lower those legs down towards that 45 degree angle. 
straight legs. Here's four, three, we're gonna put these two together, two, and one. Let's lower head down. So we're gonna lift the head first and then the legs go out. Ready? Nice and slow to start. So we go lift the head, straighten the legs, pull the legs back in, and then lower the head back down. So we go lift, out, in, down. Exhale. Reach, inhale, exhale. I just keep breathing. Now you want more of a challenge? When your legs go out, open the legs. So go up, out, in, down. So you come up, out, in, down. So you get a little quick staccato opening of those legs. All right, next one, we're gonna hold it all the way up. Hold it all the way up. Take those legs to 45. Out, in. So open and close those legs. Out. You can always modify with head on the ground. You can always take those hands, reaching for the end of the mat. Let's pulse it. Out, out. Legs out. Either hands behind the head or arms forward. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, on one, bring it all the way in. Great job. Now we're gonna take that band to your feet. Take the band to your feet. Hands are gonna go back behind your head. You're gonna come all the way up. Straighten the legs where you can. 45 or all the way up. Let's bring the right knee in and twist to the right knee. Come back center. Now the left leg pulls in and you lift your chest with that left leg and come back center. Here we go. So we go out, or we go pull, straight, pull, straight. So pull that band in and twist towards that knee. Finding that pause in the middle. That pause in the middle is so hard here. Remember, modify by taking the legs more vertical to the ceiling. Four more. Four, three, here's two. All right, let's take it up. Full bicycle abs. Pull, pull, pull. Shh. No middle here. Switch, switch. You have eight. Breathing. Four more. Four, three, two, and one. Hug those knees into your chest. Let's set the band off to the side. Time for those lower abs here. Lower abs. So legs up, hips, or lift those hips up slightly. Just put those hands. Slightly under those hips. Head's gonna stay down. Drop those, I'm sorry, squeeze those heels together. Toes slightly apart. Let's lower this leg down. Down, and then back up. Control, and then back up to the center. As you do this, you wanna lengthen the legs. Lower with control. Modify by taking it only halfway down and then all the way back up. The lower you go, the more challenging it is. Let's add a circle. So we go down to the middle, circle the legs out and around to the top. Down, out and around, 90 degrees at the top. So find that length down and then control the circle up and around. Down, out and around. Good, keep going. Is your upper body nice and still? Control. We got one more down circle. Now at the top, let's reverse that circle. Out and around, and then lift through the middle. Oh, sometimes this one's harder. That lift, double leg in the middle, out and around. Both legs lift to center. Control, and squeeze it up. We have four more. Four, and then all the way up, good. Head is relaxed. Getting those hips working here. And then last circle here, last circle. Let's take the legs down to your challenge zone. Take it all the way down. Point the toes and flutter kick those legs. Flutter kick. Keep reaching. Keep going. Strong kicks here. All right. We have eight more seconds. Stay with it. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Now we hold. Eight more seconds. Hold. Legs together. Hold it. Hold that belly button in towards that spine. Four, three. Legs go up for the ceiling and hug those knees in. Awesome job, let's roll onto your sides. Roll onto your sides. We have side planks here, side planks. Now, 
You can either be on your knee or stagger your feet. Oops. Stagger those feet from here. Top hand goes behind that head. I'm gonna show a modified version on your knee first. You're gonna crunch that knee and elbow at the top. So you're gonna come in and then extend it out. Pull it in and extend it out a little bit faster. So we go crunch, extend, crunch. All right, we got both obliques working here. Bottom side, holding those hips up. Top side, working that crunch here. So on your feet here, no knee on the ground. Makes it even harder. Crunch. Here's two. Now we're going to hold it straight. Dip those hips down. Dip them down. Up. Dip. And lift. Good. Let's go four more dips. I'm going to put them together. Four. Up. Three. Up. We're going to do a crunch first and then a hip dip. We come in, out, dip, lift. Crunch, lift, down, up. So crunch, extend. One more combo. Last one, and come all the way down. Swing those legs to the opposite side. Swing those legs off the side here. I guess we could have done this with a band. That would have mean, been mean though. All right, we ready for the other side? Hand behind your head. Top side crunches here. Crunch, extend. So working that top side oblique. Bottom side oblique is holding. Those hips off the floor. All right, hold it straight. Dip those hips down, up. Think less dip and more lift. You wanna work that squeeze at the top. Let's go four more dips. And we're gonna do a little combo in two. Here we go, crunch, then dip. Crunch, out, down, up. Crunch, extend, dip, and lift. In, out. It's slow, control. That's it. Four more combos and we're done with those abs. Four, out, down, and up. Three, out. Finish strong. Two more, two more. Here's your last one. And then come all the way down. Let's find that band one more time. Band's gonna go above of those thighs. On your backs now. So feet are gonna go as wide as the mat. Challenge your whip here. Lay on those backs. Lay on your back. Feet are wide. Yeah, I want you to bridge those hips up and lower right back down. So when you bridge your hips up, I want you to focus here on keeping that rib cage closed. Slight tuck of those hips as you come up and down a little bit faster. We go up and down. Now, as you come up and down, keep those knees pressing out of that band. Do not let those knees collapse in. Lift. Good, let's hold at the top right here. Little lifts, lifts. So both feet are flat on the floor in four, Three, hold it there, knees go out. Press the knees out. Hips high and steady. Out, out. Let's do four more right here. Four, I, I lied, it's eight. <laughs> here we go, two, and one. Drop it down, let's let those heels off the floor, on your toes, hips up and down, hips up and down. So a little variation here. Heels are off the floor. Squeeze, pulse to the top right here, little pulse. Lift, tiny, tiny lifts. Now, can you put that rib cage back down on the floor? L lower that rib cage. So you got that nice big tuck of those hips up. Four, three, hold the hips, knees go out, out, out. Hips are high and steady. Yes, here's that deep burn, here it comes. You have eight more presses out, smaller, smaller. Oh, I'm losing my band. Four, three, Two, let's lower those hips. One more set on your heels. Toes off the floor, hips up, up. Ah, this is where I feel it the most. I love it when I lift those heels or the toes off the floor. That's it. Now up at the top, hold little tiny lifts, lifts. So press that rib cage back down. That bra line is still on the floor. You're just getting that one inch lift through those hips. Four more. Three more, hips high, knees out to the end, out, out. Yes, this is it, this is it, stay with it. 
Katie, you're doing awesome. Faster, fast, fast, fast. To the end. Four, three, two, and lower all the way down. Hug those knees into your chest. Take that band off as you hug. Hug. All right. Great job. Let's come up to a seated position here. Fantastic job, Katie. Hi, Ethan. I got a little visitor today. All right, take one leg, cross it over, hug that knee into your chest. Ethan, you wanna come say hi? All right, hug that knee in. Maybe lift a little rotation through that spine. Come here, buddy. You can say hi to Katie. Come here, she's on my phone, you see her? Ethan, come here. Come here. Oh, come here. No. <laughs> All right, switch legs, hug that knee in. Katie, he can see you. He's he just staying off the camera. He's being shy. It's okay, buddy. And then twist to the side. All right, let's come up. Let's come up. Take those feet directly underneath those hips. Drop that head down. Bend those knees. Just grab a hold of opposite elbows. Decompress that spine, try to reach the head down to the ground. And then we're gonna place the hands on the ground. You're gonna straighten that right leg, take the right arm up. And then come back down, switch legs, left leg straight, left arm up. And then come back down, hands on the ground, legs wide. Let's stretch it all the way down, straddle stretch. And then come up, turn the toes out, sumo stretch. Sumo stretch, press those knees out. We're using those elbows, maybe rock side to side. Come up, take that right arm in, or right arm across straight. And the left arm. And let's roll all the way up to a standing position. Take a big deep breath in. And all the way out. Awesome job.